Hello everyone and welcome back to Lewis News, your number one YouTube channel for all types of Spider-Man news. And in today's video, it's a little bit more somber because we were expecting some Marvel Spider-Man 2 news at the Game Awards last night. However, once again, to our complete surprise, nothing. If you are new around here and enjoy all types of Spider-Man content from the games and movies and the shows, we cover it all on here, so make sure you are subscribed. And also, if you want a limited time deal on Spider-Man Miles Morales, the Ultimate Edition for PS5, I'll leave a link in the description down below where you can get yours today. But with that being said, let's get straight into the news. So yeah, obviously, as we do know, the Game Awards happened last night, and we were expecting something for Marvel's Spider-Man 2. Because we have seen nothing from the game, no trailer, no looks, absolutely nothing for that game ever since that first look trailer came out over a year ago. And this game's marketing has been so different from the first game, because if you remember, the first game was announced way back in 2016 and came out of fall 2018, but two or three things would come out every single year up to the release revealing something about the game. We had gameplay events, we had demos, we had trailers, we had a 20 minute video posted on YouTube. But then when it comes to Marvel Spider-Man 2, we have that one announcement trailer which teases Kraven. We also get a look at Peter, Miles and Venom. And that is pretty much it. Nothing about the story has been revealed. No other gameplay features have been revealed. It's literally just that. And I'm not the biggest expert on how marketing works for the gaming industry because I'm more involved in the movie industry and how that market works. I'm not really into gaming as much as movies, but it definitely seems like they're going with a different marketing strategy for Marvel Spider-Man 2 than the first game. But if we are to compare it to the movie industry whatsoever, I do think Marvel Spider-Man 2's marketing is akin to something like Spider-Man No Way Home, minus all the leaks, of course. But the hype for the game is being built on the back burner. It's it's been built on not knowing anything about the game. People are already invested in the story. People are already invested in these characters. We are two games in now, and the third one that is coming out has all of us hooked. So they are definitely building up the hype for the game in the background. But when should we expect a trailer for Marvel Spider-Man 2? This is the question that everyone is asking at the moment. Well, in my opinion, and like I said, I'm not as involved in the gaming industry, so I can't really give you a concrete theory, but I do believe that we'll probably see something at the next PlayStation event. The reason purely for this is because the game actually comes out in 2023. And looking at the way things are going, the way they haven't really spoken about the game, Insomniac and PlayStation, I do think the game will come out in either fall 2023, matching that release date that the first game had in September, or a release sometime in the winter, possibly even in December. So it's good to say that we probably have another solid year before the actual game comes out. They don't actually have an official release date for the game yet, but we do know that it will come out in the 2023 period. So I do think we are getting ever closer to that trailer, and I do think, if not at the next PlayStation event, we will have a trailer definite by the PlayStation event after that, or some kind of gaming event that is big. And I do think when we do get that trailer, I do think that will be the main event of that PlayStation event, just because this is such a big game for Sony and Insomniac. The first game and Miles Morales were both heavily successful, so I do think when this game comes to marketing, they're going to want to push it as much as possible. But anyway, that is just my theory. I want to know what you guys think in the comment section down below. When do you think we were getting a trailer since we did not get one at the Game Awards last night? I want to know all your thoughts in the comment section down below. And with that being said, make sure to leave a like on this video if you did enjoy. Make sure to hit that subscribe button so you do not miss any more Spider-Man news from the games, the movies, and the shows. We cover everything on the channel. Like I said at the start of the video, there is a limited time only on the Spider-Man Miles Morales Ultimate Edition in the link in the description down below. So make sure you go grab that if you have not got it already. It is a a great game. I love Spider-Man Miles Morales. It's absolutely awesome. With that being said, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and peace.